All right, so the hardware is still the same. What I'm doing now here is I change the software to show me the temperature sensor 1 and 2 to show what current temperature it has right now, what the sensor number, what its maximum temperature was and the minimum temperature. And then here how long we are on, how long we are running, how many seconds. And so the next step now has to be to remove the one temperature from the board, attach it to a long, very long wire, and then attach the sensor to something very, very hot. For uh, my steam heat, means that means to a pipe, right? To a pipe where I can reach like 100 degrees temperature, 100 Celsius. <coughs> and then see if this min max thing works. Um, I'm thinking about maybe taking two of the sensors off and measure the outgoing steam pipe temperature and the returning one. So how much temperature loss we have there. This would be maybe nice to know. That is so the next step there. Let me show you the software for this quick here in this area. So what do we have here? Um, We define a variable for the waiting time, so how often we we measure, so every two seconds. And then we define the values for the maximum and minimum for temperature sensor 1 and 2. This piece of code we know already, it's to initialize the LCD. We read two temperatures, two sensors. And we now directly <coughs> calculate the temperature for those. And then we calculate the minimum and the maximum temperatures of both of those sensors. That happens here. And then we display the temperature for number one with its max and minimum temperatures and there we display the temperatures for sensor number two with its maximum and minimum temperatures. That's all.